chocolate milk, my favorite thing in the entire world. I wonder how this is going to go. Hmm. Let's see how it's going to go. Okay, so I have two, two pianos set up here. Yeah, why don't you do that? There you go. Why didn't you do that from the beginning? I don't know. Okay, that was that was stupid, huh? Hello again. All right. Damn, I fucked it up. There you go, right there. I should do something different, don't you think? Cause that's just something that I know how to do. Win these games that I create. Win these games that I make up inside my head. Was it 76? I don't know what that is. Bubble? That's not bubble. That one's not very loud though. That's the problem with it. That is freaky, freaky, freaky. Speaking of freaky, human voice, that is freaky. <laughs> Didn't you write down like all the all the sounds that you wanted to use? Wasn't wasn't that part of this? <laughs> it's totally part of this. Dude, I need an extension cord so I can constantly film like everywhere I go. You know? 
because this battery life isn't very long. I'm gonna go with telephone bell once again. I just love it so much. eat my sandwich. Yeah, I know, that's for, that's for you're fucking up, you're not eating. You know? Need to eat to survive, man. Man! <laughs> Didn't you know how the human body works? Sometimes you think I don't. Sometimes you think that, I think that vodka is actually water. <laughs> you know? Anybody have a drinking problem in the vortex? Here's how you know you got a drinking problem that you probably should take seriously. You wake up and piss. If you're not doing that, fuck it, keep going. really hard on that outfit. If only you'd work that hard, you know, on your performance. Maybe you'd be as good as me. Have a little more suicidal thoughts. You'd be as good as me. Maybe quit being a pansy. There you go. Challenge yourself. Do stuff that makes you uncomfortable. Do stuff that you're afraid of. Say things that offend people. Make yourself stand out. nigger. That's all you have to do. <laughs> oh my god. You want to call me a racist? You want to call me a racist? You want to call me a racist? Well, I hate to break it to you, but my vagina would strongly disagree with you. I believe in all the colors of the rainbow. That's what my pussy says. That's what my pussy says. cookie that I made myself. That's right. If you care about your addiction. <laughs> you gotta have determination, motivation. 
motivation for your relation. That's what you gotta do, you know? So when I meet people that say they love pot, it's not true. Unless you cook with it, you don't know what the fuck to do. Reject a pox cookie, man. A lot of people just don't like it, though. They don't like the effect of it. I guess I'm just one of those, like, like. One of those like crusty old ass stoners that's like, oh, well, I cook with it, you know? <laughs> like, the only way that you appreciate it is if you cook with it. Eating a sandwich, playing piano. Why did you make more coffee? Why did you do that? Because I wanted to. Yeah, but it's like ten o'clock, baby. That doesn't matter. I mean, coffee at midnight. You know, when the moment is not right. I need some more coffee though. Especially because Jenna is coming over. She loves coffee, man. Thing is, I'll find out like something something random, something tiny, something minute, something people don't really think about. Like I'll just remember it forever, you know? Like she told me she loves coffee. I remember she takes it black. So you know what? I always have coffee in my house whenever she comes over. That's all you gotta do, man. Just figure out that one little thing. I hope we'll stay friends forever. All because of that. like right now everybody's out doing shit that people do on a Tuesday night for a lot of the people that I like they're doing comedy and there are some people that I don't like that are also doing comedy um, and it sucks because I have to deal with those people you know the risk that you take when you leave the house that most of the people that are out and about are gonna be shit heads you know don't be optimistic just just keep that negativity going because then you'll be pleasantly surprised when you meet someone such as my friend jenny who are 
hard shit. You know? It's always nice. When mostly everyone is shit. Talking shit, eating shit, watching shit, reading shit, listening to shit. Here's what I think. Okay, so the, you know how they have like TV shows that are based off movies? And I'm not saying these TV shows are bad. I'm, I mean, I've heard they're very good. Because they're based off good movies. It's like, like, uh, what, like Fargo and uh, Hannibal and... There are all these shows that are supposedly really, really good, right? They're based off these really, really good movies. Well, I think that we should just start, like, making shit that's based off everything else, too. Like, we should start making TV shows that are based off fucking Triscuits. <laughs> thought this was a TV show, but it's based off of some like, wait, 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 hold up. <laughs> okay, so Patrick Devine brought these to my house during like my first comedy therapy thing, and I don't have the heart to throw them away even though they taste like shit, that's why he left them here. They're the Mediterranean style olive triscuits. Say there was like a whole TV show based on that shit. You didn't stop recording, Mimi. Mimi? You did Did you try to say baby and Amy at the same time and you just said Mimi? <laughs> hey Mimi. Yeah, what if they had, you know, I have, what, 50 Shades of Garbage is based off Twilight fan fiction, right? So it's like shit that's based off other shit, based off other shit. <laughs> they always turn like a Nicholas Sparks book into a movie. They should turn a Nicholas Sparks book into a movie, into a song, into a commercial, into a scooter. <laughs> Since nothing's happy being itself anymore. I understand. Me neither. <laughs> That's why I talk in all these different voices. They're not my voices. I don't really know what my voices are anymore. People think they're funny, and so I do them because I make other people laugh, and that makes me laugh. It makes me happier that I make other people laugh, not just myself. That I can provide a gift for other people to unpackage and enjoy. But it's like I'm Christmas every day, you guys. Unlimited gifts and curses. That's a good baseline though. So. God damn it, I love sandwiches. Okay, stop it right now.